Okay, so I have gotten a lot of messages um, for individuals who actually want to withdraw um, money from their seller account. Okay, so I'm just going to do this video just to help out, like just to show you, you know, how to go about it. So if you already created your seller account and your seller account is already created and you've already made a sale and made, let's say, um, for instance, you're not seeing the money in your bank account, you don't know how to withdraw from your wallet, you know, and all of that, this video is going to be explaining those particular questions right so if you've not created a seller account and if you don't know how to do this you can just watch the video you know and or if you need the video i can send the video to you or just watch the video and then create the account and then and all of that but then this particular video is just to help those who have been asking this particular question so basically so once you go into your seller account like this is your seller account right for instance so this is my seller account so the next place you need to go to is to go to um, not there is to go here go to these three dots you can see here right so once you click on that three dots you can see there it's going to bring a drop down menu for you right so once you look at this drop down menu now oftentimes your money might be in your wallet might be in your wallet that's if you have not done a particular um settings right and sometimes and other times it will be sent directly into your account okay so i'm going to be showing you how to do that if you want it to be automatically set directly into your account but then if you don't have these settings that i'm going to show you that means it's going to be stored in your wallet and you are the one that has to now go down to your wallet and do your manual um withdrawal right so for you to get this directly sent into your account let me show you how you do that so once you have your here remember once you're here once you've clicked the three dotted lines it's going to bring out this drop this drop down menu for you so to set up your um your account details because first of all you have to put in your account details so that at least you're making sales now so that the money will come into your account or whichever be the case so that you then receive your money in your account right so the next thing you need to go to is to go to your settings you go down to the settings once you click on the settings it's going to bring another drop down menu for you so you screw up so once you screw up, it's going to you're going to see this payout settings, payout settings. Remember, this is the initial settings you have to do once you've created your seller account. So go to your payout settings. Then once you click on the payout settings, it's going to bring this drop down menu for you. Right now, take note. This is where you're going to indicate how you want your payment to drop in. Do you want it to be automatic in such a way that once a payment is made, it comes straight to your bank account? you know you don't have to do like manually right so you just click on the automatic and then it's going to be paid directly into your account do you understand and or if you click on this it's going to show manual so by manual it means that you will not have to be the one that have to go down to your wallet and then you have to initiate you know um your payments for you to receive the money straight up in your bank account but then when it's already on automatic you don't need to go through the hassle and through the process of doing all of that so just leave it on the automatic so like this is already on the automatic so just leave it there automatic if you don't have to be the one to do every other thing yourself so once you are done now there's already a bank details here already right i'm just going to go to change payout account details because i already have an account detail there so like you can see you have bank you have account number so just click on whatever bank you're banking with you can click on it or you can search or you can just you know if it's first bank for instance you will see fx bank if it's whatever bank you know you want to put there just put it there and then you put your account number and then you can you can now you know go to verify account details and everything will be set up so you can receive this but then if you don't do this maybe i'm going to send um if you want me to do another video on how to show you how you can you know withdraw it from your wallet right um just let me know and then i'll do that particular video